During this video, I will show you how to submit a FERPA records release request, which allows someone you choose, such as your mother or father, to access information you specify. You will start on the main UNA page and log into your UNA portal account using the portal login link located here. After you are logged in, you will be taken to your portal home screen, which gives you options to view information for academics, billing and financial aid, registration, and student life. The FERPA records release request is found in the Academics tab. You will then find the FERPA request located in the Student Records section here titled Records Release. This is where you will choose who can view and make decisions and what they are allowed to do. In order to accurately identify individuals that want to access your information, they will need to have a PIN number. A PIN has already been computer generated and entered into this box here, but you may change the PIN if you choose, but it must meet the PIN guidelines located here. After you have selected a PIN, you must now specify what information they are allowed to access academic records, student accounts records, student conduct records, or student housing records. You can choose one, two, three, or all four, but you must choose at least one for this form to work correctly. For this example, I will choose all four. You can now name up to three individuals that will have access to the specified information. You must put the name and the relationship for each individual for this form to work correctly. If you want to authorize different individuals to a specific set of records, you must submit a separate request for each individual. For example, if you would like John Doe to only have access to your academic records and Jane Doe to only have access to your student accounts records, you must submit a request for each individual separately. If you were to submit this form now, both John Doe and Jane Doe would have access to all four options. After you have made sure you have a FERPA PIN, you have chosen all the options, and you have named all of your authorized individuals, you can now review your information. Please make sure the information listed on the screen is correct. If all information is correct, you may now submit your FERPA access request. Your form will then be submitted for processing and you will receive an email within 14 business days regarding the status of your request.